G'day YouTube, my name's Tristan. Welcome to Berwick Mitsubishi. Today, I'm very, very excited to present to you this 2017 Nissan Navara D23 STX. Uh, this one has so many features, I cannot wait to show you through all of them. Let's go take a look. Now, this one is gonna be pretty thorough. The STX comes with just about more features than any other uh, ute on the market, dual cab ute. It's a 140 kilowatt, 2.3 litre twin turbo, four cylinder turbo diesel. Uses seven litres of fuel per hundred and it can tow up to three and a half tonnes, which itself is absolutely magnificent. Uh, you might even be aware that this ute uh, has been rebadged by another prestigious automobile maker and they charge you almost double the price for the privilege but you're still getting the same thing this one we're going to definitely talk about all of the accessories that it comes with i'm going to go out on a limb and say there's probably at least fifteen thousand dollars worth of extra accessories on this car and we'll go through those one by one in just a moment but let's take a look at the condition of the car in the front not a single mark on it at all. There's a bonnet protector preventing stone chips. The front bumper is absolutely perfect. A set of really, really nice alloy wheels. We'll come back to those. Body wise, not a single dent or scratch. This tells me it's all ready to go off road, but it probably has never been off road because there's not a single mark on it. We'll climb up onto the roof. Nope, nothing here either. We've got the sports bars, which you can fit your roof crossbars to. Those of you with Hawkeyes will notice we've got the blacked out door handles. They normally come with chrome. There are some special covers that go over those. Uh, same with the wheels, same with the grill. Around the back, we've got the factory fitted optional uh, reverse sensors. This car does come with its own factory reverse camera and has one of the highest resolution screens that uh, is out in a production utility. So really, really great to know. Fitted with the genuine Nissan tow bar, three and a half ton towing capacity rated. Underneath the back of the car, we'll get to the suspension upgrade soon, but full coil rear end. In the back, we've got a tub liner with the movable and removable uh, tie down point. So they're movable all the way around. There is a 12 volt outlet just over there in the tub. So you can put all of your fridges and camping equipment ready to go and also the double opening rear window fully tinted canopy and again as promised we'll come back to all of these extra features there are so many to talk about privacy tinted windows in the back Plenty of space for your tools or camping equipment. If you have some friends or family, you can bring them along. Just put the back seat down. Really, really easy. Underneath here, there's a couple of compartments. One for your tools. The second uh, has the tow bar ball down in there, wrapped up in bubble wrap. That tells me this car hasn't really towed much either. Air vents in the back, electric powered rear window, leather seats, leather door cards, chrome handles, upgraded floor mats. These are weatherproof floor mats. They lock into place in the floor, perfectly molded. Same goes for in the front, and we'll do a full feature of this cabin in just a moment. Just giving you a look. 
What a car. I'm not going to lie, this is one of my favourite four-wheel drives on the market. I would definitely love to own this one, that's for sure. Someone's done all of the hard work for you, spent all the money, and it's ready to go. So we touched on it earlier, now it's time to get into those accessories. Now I believe, in my mind, that there's probably at least $15,000 worth of extra aftermarket and genuine accessories fitted to this car. First off, you'll notice it's much, much higher. That's due to a set of 17 inch black alloy wheels and a one inch tire lift, along with a two inch suspension lift with the extra cylinders there. For the suspension travel, you're going to notice there's a black and silver theme here. So we've got the blacked out grill, the blacked out bonnet guard, the blacked out weather shields, blacked out door handles, tinted windows. Also the canopy with the three lifting windows, that's actually an option. Uh, most people just have sliding windows here. So this one, you can definitely get in and out, camp out of it, live out of it, work out of it, whatever you need it for. We did mention the floor mats, but here they are again. Definitely not cheap. And over here in the driver's seat, you'll notice a couple of extra buttons and gauges that the normal Navaras don't have. First one is the electric drive, iDrive pedal adapter here. This one actually gives you increased pedal performance and feel, makes the car accelerate uh, quicker if you want to, and it also allows you to option that to change it to be more or less responsive as you're driving. Here's your switches for your uh, headlights, your gigantic spotlights on the front of the car, which we'll get to in a second. And also very important for that three ton tow capacity is the trailer brake system. And how can we not mention this beautiful Fabwitz snorkel fully custom unit there with the stainless steel piping k and n air filter means you never have to replace that uh, also gives you increased fuel economy and performance normally these cars do seven liters per hundred uh, another custom bracket there we also have a custom window washer bottle here so that's full of water Behind the grille, we've got the ginormous driving lights and also the light bar, all built in, all hidden. No one's going to pinch your lights, no one's going to break them or knock them off because they're all tucked away nicely behind the grille. Very, very clean look. You'll see under here also the rear suspension has been upgraded with airbags. Again, excellent for towing. Absolutely amazing and a very high dollar item that the customer has added to this car. Standard exhaust system. Let's have a listen to the snorkel. Perfect, not too much. Sounds just right. Really, really great note. Just quickly, I'm six foot three. Let's try on the back seat, make sure there's enough room for the whole family and all your fishing buddies to go away in this beautiful ute. There definitely is. Uh, you can see down here, leg room. That's where I would sit. So there's still room for me. I've got the air vents down here blowing the really crispy, cool air conditioning. Uh, it's actually pretty comfortable. I've got to say, nice spongy seat. It's not a hard, flat, right angle seat. Uh, you do get some cushioning, you fall into it. It's really nice. It doesn't feel like you're sitting on a box. So I can definitely vouch comfortable back seats. Into the driver's seat. Here we go, 
We've got the warning, the door's not closed properly. All color screen here, all changeable. You can check everything you want on the display, all from just pushing the page over button on the steering wheel. Bluetooth, cruise control, everything's nice and easy to reach. Audio controls, channel, everything there on the radio. Over here we've got the satellite navigation. If you're looking for us in Berwick, here we are on Kangan Drive. Come down and see us, take a test drive. You've got dual zone climate control. You've also got the high and low temperature for the seat warmers. If you're doing some camping or some skiing, you'll definitely need those. To the main focus of this vehicle, it's a four wheel drive. Uh, you've got two wheel drive, four wheel drive high, and you've got four wheel drive low. For two wheel drive and four wheel drive high, you've got shift on the fly. At any speed under 100 k's an hour, you can flick that over and you've got full grip all wheel drive. Uh, if you do want to go into low range and do some off roading, you do need to stop the car, put it into neutral, click it into four wheel drive low, and then jump forward and you'll feel it all click into gear. You've got an LSD. Um, and you've got the fully independent rear suspension. So one of the most capable off-road utes on the market, without a doubt. So definitely worthwhile testing its capabilities. You've got auto dimming mirror, hello. And you've also got the compass so you know which way is up. A lot of space. You've got drink holders down in the door cards, drink holders right here, right in front of your air conditioning vent so you can keep your soft drink cold. If it's winter time and you've got a coffee, same goes, blow warm air on there, keep everything nice and warm for you. Push button start, on and off, sensor key, closes the car, so fully, fully equipped. You cannot go wrong with this STX. So thanks for watching my presentation on this 2017 Nissan Navara STX with just about every option you could think of fitted on there. It's got 57,000 kilometers and it's looking for a brand new home today. So make sure you give us a call at Berwick Mitsubishi. Make sure you like this video. If you know anyone that's looking for a new Navara, some adventure in their life or needs to get some serious work done, send them our way, send them this video and we'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.